I've been on some acting forums lately, and I've seen a lot of questions and complaints from actors who are looking for their paychecks. Um, these are typically actors that have gotten booked on non-union jobs, and they've gone, you know, six, seven, eight weeks, and they still haven't received their payment for the shoot yet. Um, this is a problem with not having any sort of contract going into a shoot. And this is why it's always great to have representation. It's why I encourage everyone to be a part of a talent agency. Even if you are not union, a part of SAG-AFTRA, it's great to have an agency because they represent your interests and they will do things like have some sort of contract in place that kind of spells out the terms of things like what the project is going to be used for, how much money you should be getting paid, uh, and even things like the payment schedule, how, how quickly they need to pay you. By not being a part of SAG-AFTRA, you may be dealing with clients that are not necessarily legally obligated to follow the same sort of payment guidelines they would need to follow if they were booking a SAG after a talent. Now, this doesn't mean that these clients are trying to screw you or they're not going to pay you. It just means that everything is sort of up in the air. And that's why it's very important to have established guidelines before you walk onto a set. Even if you're not with a talent agency, uh, it's good to spell out all these terms up front. As simple as, you know, what is the project being used for? What are these specific things it's being used for? How are you going to use, you know, my image or my video, whatever, whatever it is, and exactly how much am I being paid as a talent? And when can I expect that money to be paid and who's it going to be coming from. Um, oftentimes, this money is not necessarily coming from the person that hired you. So you might be hired by the production company for a commercial, but ultimately it might be the end client, whoever you're doing a commercial for that's actually paying for your services. So sometimes the payment needs to go from the client to a casting director or to your agent and to you. And sometimes that process can take a long time. So it's better to know upfront who's paying you, what sort of time frame you're looking at, um, and have all these things established before you go into the shoot. Remember, if you want to learn how to make better films and act on camera, Guerrilla Film School has got you covered. We put together a free training video on how directors and actors can work together on set. You can get instant access to this free training right now by going to guerrillafilmschool.com slash training. He's gone.